Hello, welcome to New Life Scientific. Uh, today, we're going to be talking a little bit about the Janus uh, liquid handling system. Uh, the particular model we're working on is the Janus Mini uh, with a various span 8 uh, pipetting system. Uh, great thing about this, doesn't take up a lot of space. Very precise in both the amount that it dispenses and the placement uh, of the unit. Uh, software is a little different than a lot of uh, the software on other liquid handlers. Um, of course, like most of them, it's very easy to, uh, to generate a protocol. Simply click, drag uh, type of arrangement. But once you press the uh, run, it is automatically generates a user interface for getting the, the uh, protocol ready, the SA ready, uh, both in, uh, in, in gathering up the unit, to running it, to clean up the, the entire uh, unit. Here we're in the select what protocol. We can go into the gather section, which tells the end user what uh, deckware is going to need, he's going to need to gather uh, to assemble uh, the, uh, for the deck. We can, it has a check mark system, although it's more as just a reminder that yes, we ch or that we've gathered all those up. It also has a link for ordering of the product. So if you're out of tips, finds out yours, you can go ahead and order them right from here. When you go to the place section of the menu, it gives you a graphic representation of the deck and where everything goes. And when you get ready to it, when the end user is ready to assemble it, they can click on the item, it'll show them what the picture is, it highlights on the deck where, what numbers it goes, it tells you what position on the, uh, the deck that it's to go. And again, it has a check mark type of a system. And when we select the run, it comes up with the default menu, it tells me, okay, I'm ready to start this menu. Comes up into a sub-menu saying, uh, telling you that it needs tips uh, or that, that you need to verify the tips. In this case, it shows that there was no tips uh, remaining in the last run, we're going to tell it to fill. It it, now it has 96 tips available. When we start the run, it's going to go ahead and start the run. Um, here we're showing off the, the various span 8, although it does, this particular protocol does not show the separation, that, uh, but the various span um, can, it moves each tip independently, both in width, height, uh, how much it's going to dispense. Uh, this is a just a little routine that uh, I wrote just to move uh, uh, one tip uh, around. It has no practical value, but it's kind of fun to watch. Um, at the end of the run, uh, it will go ahead and um, ask if you want to perform it give the, that same protocol again, um, or you can quit the protocol and go on to the next uh, deckware setup. Um, there's a lot of available deckware options for this unit available. Uh, you're seeing here the most of a, of a rinse uh, system here. There's normally be a, a tub here. Um, of course, the, the, the uh, uh, the shoot, the tip shoot, um, it, well plates, there are different size well plate holders, there's several different sizes of tips available, um, uh, shakers and all sorts of, of things available for these units. Um, although we do have some uh, deckware available, we, we don't have the everything that is available for it. Um, also, there's different size syringes available for it in case you've got uh, volumes that are greater than 
um, if you have large volume or minor volumes, uh, it's paired with the proper size um, uh, syringe so you get a very exact count. There it's completed the run. Uh, the system reports what's and lets you go on to complete it, to quit, to, to perform a cleanup, whatever. Oh, uh, that's the Janus Mini system. Um, they are available in different sizes, uh, different lengths, but this is great for small labs uh, uh, that maybe don't have a lot of space, don't need a lot of different various deckware uh, available. Uh, this may be the unit for you, and it's going to be available in our Crider Crider's location. Thank you very much.